of ready to retire, a network of support and developmental tools to help women thrive in work and life. Joining us now with details on the Women, Wine and Wardrobe Benefit event is Chicago's only James Beard award-winning sommelier, Belinda Chang. Thank you so much for being here. Hi, I'm oh. so thrilled to be here and I brought my entire kitchen. Oh, and yeah, you did. So it looks let's yummy. Have some fun. Oh, let's have some yes. fun. And this is such a fabulous event because it is a lot of fun, but it's doing a lot of good too. Yeah, so we're doing perfect pairings this year. So we have some beautiful wines. We have a Sauvignon Blanc from Cycles Gladiator Ooh. and also their Cabernet Sauvignon. We're going to see who gets which. And then we're doing, oh, you might want to open, open it before it. I pour it. Okay. I've done that before. Yeah. <laughs> but we're celebrating women and what they can do and what they can do together. So Thank you. all of the perfect pairings come from our friends. They come from women founded companies, mm. companies that are designed to empower women. It's their mm. entire mission. That's great. So we're going to start over on this side. Okay. Are you ready? Yeah, okay. okay. Fantastic. So I love these cocktails. They're tip top cocktails. They fit in your purse. You can also customize them. Ooh. Give them a little bit of a shake. Give them a little shake. So I've got the bees knees in here, and I also oh. added a little Sauvignon Blanc as well. So it's basically gin with a little bit of honey, and you also have Sauvignon Blanc added to it to make it a Sauvignon Blanc perfect pairing, a cocktail and a wine. Uh -huh. okay. yeah. Hey, I, there's nothing <laughs> wrong with that. And you're saying there's a whole bunch of different different uh, drinks that they come in these little so cans. So many different things. So this is the party. You're going to come. Yeah. You're going to be able to taste all these things. We're going to add one more thing. Oh, cool. I love to make the cocktails for morning, maybe a little oh. more gentle. Oh, okay. So we're going to use a little Perrier flavor. Perfect. So I'm adding grapefruit to that just to make it a little brighter and to give it a little more flavor. So That's this is fun. just a fun cocktail for breakfast. I love it. Also for Ooh. during our what show. Are the, what other flavors does this come in? So they do Negroni, Manhattan, Ooh, right. daiquiri, Ooh. margarita. Ooh, and these great. little cans really hold the chill well. So you can, you know, chill them up, fill your purse with them, go out to the party. Ooh, there you yes. go. Fantastic. Fantastic idea. And they are a little on the stronger side if you have them neat, but I love to shake them like we did and add a little bit of something, some okay. other flavorings nice. to make it something bright. Okay, so you might need something to eat after mm -hmm. these two things mm -hmm. I gave you to drink. Mm -hmm. So we have Cypress Grove Creamery in California. So I have a little plate oh, if you want to okay, have a go. little mm -hmm. taste. Mm -hmm. yep. Humboldt Fog is their most famous cheese, and this is a woman-owned and founded creamery in the cheese oh my gosh, space. It looks beautiful we too. love these goat's milk mm. cheeses. Oh, and yeah. I thought a really fun pairing is from the Planting Hope Company. This is also founded by a classmate of mine from the Illinois Math and Science Academy, Julia Stamberger. It's called the Planting Hope Company, and they do plant forward and good for the world snacks. Ooh. So these are called Mosaics Chips, and Ooh, they're made good. with peas and carrots. So you get yeah. a little veggie. They do and olives. So great. They do hummus and all kinds of spreads. So for the party next week, we're going to be taking these and making them into elevated runway ready Ooh, canapes. I love with that. With Chef Henry. Hill, so that's going to be a really fun part of the party too. So they make delicious. all these crunchy things that I think will be fun with the cheeses, and I love this as a Sauvignon Blanc bite. Mm. Yeah, that's something really good. that's light and bright. Goat cheese with Sauvignon Blanc is a really classic pairing. They do it in the Loire Valley in France and all over the world. I think it's a nice, perfect pairing. That's okay. fun. And I see yeah. you brought us some nice sweets too. Yeah, there some are beautiful. all kinds of more things. So chocolate with Cabernet Sauvignon. That's a pretty classic that, thing to do. Red wine with chocolate. This is my friend L who owns. Sugoi Sweets, which is over on Augusta and Ashland. It's only open on Saturdays, so okay. you gotta get your butt over there. But she hand paints every <gasps> single one of these bonbons oh to order, and she has really fun flavors. This one, Chicago Corn, which I thought would be a fun one to taste, but you know, whatever you like. There's peanut butter and jelly, which would like be a fun one. one here. Do it. Ube. Ooh, so there's all these nice. Asian flavors, American flavors. There's a little bit of everything, but look, look at the inside of that. I mean, each one is just a piece of so art but pretty. also delicious and also wine friendly mm -hmm. so you know we love to have like a pairing party and pair wines with cheese but wines oh. and chocolate is also a Always really fun good. way to go yeah okay. I think, do you yeah. have a, a box cocktail too she yeah absolutely okay we have all kinds of fun things so we have an espresso martini oh. everybody is so excited about the espresso martini but we changed it just a little bit usually that's vodka some kind of chocolate liqueur maybe mm -hmm. some cold brew yeah we use metropolis coffee cold brew and sesame milk. So this one 
It's from a company called Hope and Sesame, which is also part of the Planting Hope Company. Got it. Mm -hmm. So we're going to make a espresso martini, but like it's a little more creamy, a little richer. Mm -hmm. This one's got a little vanilla to it. So I've got that all shaken and pretty and ready to go. Okay. And that's a fun one. And you can also splash a little Cabernet Sauvignon to it because I love to make a cocktail into a wine tail. That is so funny. It's so beautiful and adds a little bit of like a fruit flavor, which okay. I think is really fun. That's great. Great. And, and we're almost got, out of time. We want to make sure we get all the details oh, for the yeah. event. Yes. So October 6th, we're going to be at the Baker McKenzie 50th floor. We'll give you the link to all the tickets. It's $95 and you get all of this wow. and more. We're going to eat and drink like royalty and help women in the process. And I can't wait. That's oh, awesome. that is amazing. Belinda, this is good. This is really I mean, you, you really feel good about giving your money. Yeah, right. <laughs> so, I mean, you're going to have a multi-course yes, meal yes, and absolutely. have a lot of fun and yeah. do good at the same time. Absolutely. Belinda, this is a fantastic spread. Thank you for coming in and sharing it with us. Always my pleasure. All right.